Assalamu alaikum everyone, my name is Abdurrahman Turpan from Afghanistan. In today's video, I'm going to show you three ways to transfer WhatsApp from Android to iPhone. With these three methods, you can transfer all your WhatsApp messages with all the attachments like photos, videos, voice messages from Android to iPhone. So make sure you watch this video till the very end because at the end of this video, I'm going to tell you an important thing about this topic. So make sure you watch this video till the very end. And also, if you find this video helpful by any means, then please share it with your friends. Sharing is always free guys, it doesn't cost you anything. So with that being said, let's get started. Okay, our first method is using email to transfer WhatsApp from Android to iPhone. To do that, first of all, open up your WhatsApp. Next, select the conversation that you want to transfer to your iPhone. So as you can see, in this conversation, we have a lot of photos, videos, voice messages, etc. So in order to transfer these messages to your iPhone, just tap on these three dots. Next, tap on more. Next, select export chat. Now it will give you two options, one is include media and the other one is without media. If you want to transfer media files like photos, videos, etc, then you can select include media. If you want to transfer only text messages, you can select without media. So I'm just gonna select without media. Next select Gmail from this option. Now send this conversation to your own self. Okay, once you receive the messages on your iPhone, just open your Gmail. And as you can see, this is the WhatsApp conversation with my friend. So as you can see, these conversations are very messed up. But the problem with this method is, you cannot restore these messages to your WhatsApp app on your iPhone. And also, you can only transfer one conversation at a time. So that is the con of this method. Our second method is using a third party software to transfer WhatsApp from Android to new phone. And the software I'm gonna use is called Dr. Phone WhatsApp Transfer. You can get the software from the link given in the description below. The software is available for Windows as well as Mac users. So just go ahead, download and install the software. Link will be given right in the description below. Once you install the software into your computer, just open it up. This software is one of my favorite smartphone management software. This software is especially designed for Android and iOS users. With this tool, you can do a lot of great stuff like you can recover any kind of deleted files from your Android and iOS devices. You can transfer data between your phone and your computer. You can also remove lock screen from your Apple and Android devices. You can transfer data between one phone to another and you have a lot of more options. Okay, in order to transfer WhatsApp messages from Android to iPhone, just click on this WhatsApp transfer option. First of all, I recommend you to backup your WhatsApp messages from your Android phone to your computer. Just in case something goes wrong during transferring process, your WhatsApp messages will be saved in your computer. So that's what I'm gonna do now. I'm gonna backup my WhatsApp messages from my Android phone. Once backup is completed, I will restore that backup to my iPhone. So first of all, let me quickly backup my WhatsApp messages from my Android phone. Okay, now the software is backing up my WhatsApp messages. Okay, now the backup is completed. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to restore this backup to my iPhone. So that way I will have all my WhatsApp messages transferred from my Android to my iPhone. Okay, now I'm going to disconnect my Android phone and connect my iPhone to PC. Now I'm going to restore my Android WhatsApp backup to my iPhone. Okay, now select the backup file. Here's my backup file. Click next. Click on restore. If you are already using WhatsApp on your iPhone, then click on yes. 
and if you are not using whatsapp on your ios device click the so in my case i'm not using whatsapp on my iphone so i'm just going to select no and click next okay now what you have to do is log in to whatsapp on your iphone okay now i'm going to log in to my whatsapp Okay, once you are successfully logged into your WhatsApp on your iPhone, just click on this blue button. And after that, the transferring process will begin. Now, this transferring process will take time depending on how much WhatsApp messages you have on your Android phone. So, I'm just going to pause the video over here. I will come back when it's done. Okay, the restoration process is completed. Now, your iPhone will restart and after that, you should have all your WhatsApp messages transferred from your Android phone to your iPhone. Okay, now you can see these are the messages that were stored on my Android phone. If you face any kind of problem during transferring process, just contact the software's support team. To do that, just click on this menu button. Next, click on contact us and it's going to take you to Wondershare's official support page. From here, you can contact them and get your problem solved. They also have a live chat here, so you can solve your problem instantly our third and last method is using another software to transfer whatsapp from one phone to another and this software is called tenoshare iCare phone i will also leave the link of the software in the description below basically this is a file manager software for computers but with this software you can also transfer whatsapp from one phone to another so just go ahead download and install the software after that open it up once the software is opened click on social app transfer and select whatsapp transfer now connect both your phones to pc using a usb cable Once your phones are connected, as you can see on the left side, you will have your source phone. Now this is the phone that's going to transfer the data and destination phone will receive the data. So in my case, I'm going to transfer WhatsApp from my Android phone to my iPhone. So I'm just going to click on this option, flip option and it's going to change the order. Once everything is made sure of, just click on start transfer. Once again, you need to log in to WhatsApp on your iPhone. Okay, once you are logged in successfully, just click on OK. And after that, just click on Yes. Okay, now the transferring process will begin. Now, at this point, do not use either of your phone. Just leave your phones as they are. So now this process will take time. So I'm just going to pause the video over here and I will come back when it's done. During this process, you will get some instructions like this. So all you need to do is follow the instructions provided by the software. Okay, now the transferring process was successful. Now you should have all your WhatsApp messages transferred from your Android device to your iOS device. After the transferring process is completed, your iPhone will restart. After restarting, you should have all your WhatsApp messages transferred to your iPhone. Okay, now let's see. Let's open WhatsApp. Now you can see these are the messages which were stored on my android device now it's on my iphone first of all i would like to thank you guys so much for watching this video up until this point now let me tell you the important thing the thing is that the software used in this video are not free you have to purchase them currently there are no free ways to transfer whatsapp from android to iphone or iphone to android you have to purchase at least one whatsapp transfer software to get your job done so that is the bad news for you guys Maybe in the future people will find a way to do it, but for now, that's it for you guys. So once again, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed this video, then please give it a thumbs up. 
and also share it with your friends. And if you want more videos like this, then please subscribe to my channel with notification on. And I'll catch you on the next one. Stay blessed, stay safe. Peace.